Okay, I'll admit, I enjoy way too much vlogging. My elementary school buddy actually works in a restaurant called Six by Nico. And today I'm going there with my friend Eilish. So, the plan is I'm heading to Old Witch right now to pick her up and then we're gonna go there for dinner. So, I'm wearing this little skirt from Telly Whale. My belt is from New Look. This jumper, I believe, is from Bershka. I got it a while ago, but... It's generally one of my favorites. Also, I did order a new pair of dogs, so we should be getting those very soon. I'll bring my little Fiorelli bag I got from TK Maxx this summer. I'm also gonna take my laptop to do some editing, and then I have this one for Alish. I actually need to open it up again to add some chocolate in it as well, so. I generally thought they were gonna be all different, but they're all the same. Also guys, this is what I'm giving her. It says easy peasy lemon squeezy, which is something that we used to say all the time. And so, yeah, I think it'll be cool. I know she loves socks as well. Can't get this boat to a place where I like it. It's not perfect, but that's the best I can do. I think I'm ready to go. Okay, time to pick Eilish up. Hello. Welcome to my restaurant. Thank you. You look gorgeous. I love your hair like this. Hey, yo. It's so cute. You're gonna laugh. Is it a penis? No. Come on. You got it. What do I drink then? It's very lovely. Hello, so it's a couple of days later. I've been working in the last couple of days and so I haven't really got a chance to pick up this vlog. I do wanted to show you guys this little hoodie though. I'm pairing it with my sweats from H&M and I'm literally obsessed with a hoodie. I got it from New Look from the kids section. Yes, you heard it right. I went shopping on the 2nd of January and I'm pretty sure I wanted to bring you guys along. But then once I got to Stratford, I just didn't bring the camera out and also this is literally the only thing I could find. I wanted to get a pair of Dr. Martins. I wanted to get a sweater from Berska, but I couldn't find anything, so I had to order both of them online. My Dr. Martins parcel did came, so I will show you guys this in this vlog. But yeah, before I go ahead and open my dock, I actually wanted to try something out. So I got this little guy on Black Friday, but I'm still yet to try it. So this is what the applicator looks like. Nice, very interesting. Okay. I mean, it's not bad. I actually do really like it. The consistency, it's very weird. Not what I was expecting at all. Well, I try not to let the camera fall and this is the result. So much for a new sweater. Okay, so for starters, I am obsessed with the color. It's definitely a bit hard to get a perfect shape, so it's definitely more of a everyday sort of lipstick. Definitely good for those days where you want to put some colors on, but you don't want to like make the effort. Pretty sure by the time I eat something, this will be gone, but I definitely do not hate it. I kind of love this coral color as well, so. If anyone is wondering, this is the shade I got. It's called Teacher's Pet. Okay, let's open my Dr. Martins now, shall we? Are we bloody ready? I could, you know, I'm so excited to open this. So, let's just do it. I don't know what's under all this wrapping, so I'm already so excited. What on earth? <laughs> they look lovely. I am simply obsessed. I needed a new pair of Dr. Martins so bad and these are so cute Oh my god, gorgeous I mean, it feels very different to my other Dr. Martins but I feel like it's been a while since I had a new pair I'm not planning on leaving the house today 
I have quite a few things I need to get done. I need to edit a cover and then I am planning on playing guitar, update my college book, doing a little manifestation mood board as well for 2023. So yeah, I got quite a few things on my agenda, but I am pretty confident we can toggle them all up. As you can tell though, I'm in the kitchen because I'm starving and I have some pad thai left over so I think I'm gonna warm that up I really wish you guys could smell this I usually swap with this guy that works in front of my restaurant and I could you not, he makes the best pad thai ever and I was too stressed to enjoy it yesterday so I had plenty of it left over and when I had that I just warm it up the following day I had some lime, some ginger and some hot sauce as well. I guess we'll also see how long this lipstick actually stays on. Yeah, that's good. I've been working on a song the last couple of hours and I think it's time for a snack. I've got these little ones from Lidl and I think they're super cute. I tried the brownie vanilla one last night and it was so good. So I'm actually very intrigued about this caramel biscuits and cream okay let's do a taste test oh my god shut up this is so good wow surely gonna enjoy the rest of this and then i might give you guys a sneak peek of the song i might not i don't know i feel like i had a lot to write about in the last couple of days and so I'm just getting it out of my system. Yeah, I don't know how to tell you that I I like the color of his eyes And the way he makes me smile I like the feeling I get when I open up his sex and I And the way we tease each other And the way I can't stop I think it's a bang. I never really share my songs when they're like in the early stages, not on YouTube anyway. I did it sometimes on Instagram, which you should definitely follow me on Instagram if you haven't done so already. Bunny underscore official, go ahead and follow me because we're definitely having a fun time over there as well. I still need to write a second verse and adjust the first verse, I guess. But yeah, I think we'll do that off camera. Okay, I pretty much have no lipstick left whatsoever. I'm back in the kitchen, super starving, so I think we're gonna make some dinner. I think I'm gonna make some rice with mint and green apple. Okay, so I have rice in one pan, mint in the other. Next step is to chop my apple. So I just added some onion powder and also some herbs and salt. I am very excited for this. Now I'm gonna add the apple in as well. There we have it. Taste this. Hmm. I'm really obsessed. Hello and welcome to the last part of this vlog. Today is the last day that I'm gonna bring you guys along until the next vlog, I guess. Let me know in the comments if you like me to keep doing this. Today I go ready because I'm having a photo shoot with my friend Andrea. Also, I did get a notification that my Bershka parcel has been delivered to my workplace. So I'm gonna go there now, get it, and then I have another cute outfit as well so that you know, I can change during the photo shoot. Talk about a sun. Okay, I just got it. I'm gonna do a quick unboxing and I'm gonna go because I'm gonna get late. I mean, that is looking promising. Oh well. Yeah, this skirt is not gonna fit me whatsoever. It's going to be. But I guess that's my problem because I wanted it so bad. So I got it on the only size they had available, which is a medium. <laughs> I'll have to try all these things on, but I do think this will fit me. And then, are you guys ready for the piece? I mean, not gonna lie, I'm planning on wearing this for the photo shoot as well. How cute is it? I'm literally obsessed. Anyway, I'm gonna pack this whole thing up and then go. Massive this thing is.
Ty, ty lusy jsou na? No, od zero. <laughs> Ten, ne? Tady, no. Ok, so I'm back from the photo shoot. It was so cold outside. Good thing we decided to shoot inside. I made myself a little hot cocoa to warm me up, which was so good. Like, the candy cane on top would 100% recommend. I feel kind of thirsty, so I think I'm gonna make a little ginger shot. I guess you guys will see how I usually make my ginger shot more appealing, and that is with ton of ice. A little bit of syrup so they're not that harsh they'll be like sweeter and then I also like to add apples and usually I would add lemon slice I don't have any lemons right now so I'm adding some lime slices instead C G E F G interesting so these are the ginger shot that I use. I get them from Lidl and I like them because they're 115 milliliters. I'm not sure if that's a thing everywhere or if we only used to do this in Italy, but I always love to play with a little can. This is looking so good already, but what I like to do is I like to add a tiny bit of syrup as well. And then we give it a nice stir. And there you have it. This is Definitely way cuter than a regular ginger shot and mm. it's also way yummier. Cheers! Okay, so I've seen this on Instagram and it looks super yummy so we're gonna try it. I really hope this tastes good. So I basically added some honey onto my poofy paste and I also added some herbs and I just twist the whole thing together and this is what I'm left with. In the video that I'm following, they added more honey and some oil. I think I'm actually gonna chop the salami up and sprinkle that on top because that looks like something I would do. So I'm currently looking through the photos that I took with Andre so that I know which one I want to edit and then post eventually. We haven't done one in a while, so oh and that is my dinner. Okay. Oh my god, it looks so good. Put it on the plate. It's actually quite hot, so let me put this down. I'm actually very excited to try this. I'm eating it with a fork right now because it's still quite hot, so... Taste test! Okay! Okay. 10 out of 10. So it's a while later. I just finished to have dinner and I thought I'll share with you guys the bits that I got from Veriska. So this is how the jumper looks on. Not gonna lie, I'm literally obsessed with it. I thought it was gonna be so yeah, I'm very very happy with it. Then this is the skirt and it kind of looks good with the top itself but it is definitely big. I mean, I could definitely fit a lot in there. I'm pretty sure this is the way it's supposed to fit, but it's not the way it actually fits me because I got a size too big because I definitely wanted to give this a go, but yeah, I'll have to return this one. Then this is the dress. I am not really sure what to do with it. I can't tell if I love it or I hate it. I do think the print is super cute and this bit is literally what all my dresses looks like so I should definitely be into it. I do think it's the way the skirt kind of goes that way and just the way it looks around my tummy that I'm not too sure about. Like these look so big but then the extra small was too small. I mean, I, I don't even know. I don't even know. But yeah, I think I'm gonna finish the vlog here, which is definitely weird because I don't think I've ever finished the vlog. I usually just like fade them out, but I hope you guys enjoy it. If you did, of course, be sure to give me a big thumbs up. Tell me in the comments below if I should do more of these. And of course, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe for a brand new cover every Tuesday and a main channel video or vlog every Friday. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!